Wendy Williams has elevated the expression, say it as you mean it, to a whole new level. But for many people, the expression lacks significance. Williams, a former talk show presenter, renowned for her outspoken opinions, has recently met headlines for her daring revelations. Williams discussed the confluence of hip-hop and homosexuality in a recent interview, and even mentioned Diddy in the process. Hello everyone, and welcome to another video. Today we'll be looking at, Diddy slaps Wendy Williams for leaking his gay pictures to the media. Yeah, you heard it right. Williams is rumored to possess a photograph of two naked males, one of whom appears to be pulling down the underwear of the other. There is speculation that one of these individuals is Diddy. Given Williams' reputation for speaking the truth and supporting her claims with solid evidence, these allegations are considered seriously. Jaguar Wright, a former singer, has also disclosed controversies involving prominent musicians such as Diddy and Alicia Keys. Wright remains committed to uncovering new information and casting light on these issues, receiving criticism for doing so. Williams and Wright are brazenly speaking out against the silence of the majority. In this instance, Diddy's erstwhile security guard, Gene Deal, appears to be on the correct side of the argument. While Jaguar Wright has made numerous allegations, Deal has addressed the majority of them and provided evidence to support some of the claims. He acknowledged that he frequently receives information from others and corroborated the veracity of some of Wright's claims. However, Deal also refuted Wright's claims that he was compensated to remain silent and commended her efforts to cast light on the situation. He then elaborated on allegations about Diddy's sexuality by describing an incident from years ago in a Philadelphia club where he witnessed Diddy advising R&B musician Music Soul Child to remove his turban. Deal emphasized the significance of addressing Wright's allegations, but he also stated that he was not paid off and had not been blackmailed. He refuted Wright's claims about him and clarified that he did not know her personally. While he admired her work, he believed that she was incorrect in this instance and may have been referring to another individual. It appears that you're not referring to Big Gene, who has extensive experience with Mary Faith and the entire Bad Boy team during the aforementioned time period. Please feel free to share your thoughts on this in the comments section of my YouTube channel. My phone number is 201-969-6168 for anyone who wishes to communicate with Big Gene directly, he said. Deal defended himself against the accusations, possibly proving right in Wendy's and his points. He stated that several things that he witnessed while working for his former employer prompted him to seek solace in God and the Bible. The agreement then mentioned Mary J. Blige, an additional musician against whom Jaguar had made allegations. Wright asserted that the singer concealed a desire for women for years before the Diddy affair, and even challenged her to a match. Deal praised Wright's work while expressing disagreement with her accusations against him. After receiving criticism for Summer Walker, Jaguar Wright turned her attention to other celebrities. She challenged Mary J. Blige on Instagram asserting that Blige had concealed her sexuality for years. Wright persisted, despite resistance, taunting Blige about her abilities and fabricating sexual activity allegations against her. Former security guard Gene Deal also weighed in on the controversy, bolstering Wright's claims that Diddy is allegedly homosexual. Deal described a situation in which he was asked to monitor the door of a gay bar while Diddy and another man were inside. Deal asserted that he witnessed the two men sprint out naked and that he had previously witnessed a similar conduct. These statements appeared to corroborate Wright's accusations against Diddy, and Deal was adamant that he had witnessed that Wright claimed to a witness. Gene made disturbing allegations against music mogul Diddy in a recent interview, adding the swelling number of allegations against him while working for Diddy in the early 2000s. Gene allegedly took him to an exotic bookstore where he purchased a bag of sex devices for his children. Gene further claimed that Diddy planned to visit Ja Rule after a concert in North Carolina and carried the toys with him, despite Gene's efforts to dissuade him. Numerous social media users have expressed disbelief at these reports, but Gene is not the only person with fascinating stories to share. Wendy has spoken out against the prevalent homophobia in the hip-hop community, stating that it is superfluous to deny one's sexual preferences. Wendy's career is coming full circle as a result of the recent discussion of Diddy's sexual preferences, which has resurrected several old situations. Although he has been romantically linked to several high-profile women, including the late Kim Porter, Diddy's actions throughout the years have created a different impression. Despite his repeated denials of being homosexual, the issue remains. Does he enjoy the company of men? Christian Combs, one of the many offspring of Diddy's relationships, is currently pursuing a vocation in entertainment. Hip-hop's perversive homophobia has caused significant harm to the American society, even though Diddy's sexuality is still a matter of debate. Even progressive musicians such as J. Cole have been criticized for using anti-gay slurs in their lyrics. Nonetheless, circumstances may change in the future. In a recent music video, a rapper questioned his fear of being loved and hinted that he may surmount it one day. So that's all for today's video. 
If you enjoyed it, remember to leave a like, subscribe, and ring that bell icon so that you never miss our upcoming videos. And don't forget to share your thoughts in the comment section down below. Stay tuned, and we'll catch you in the next video.